I fell out, I, I lost this out there, but but as a stutcher, well, it's it's Dixon now. I am um, actually married now to um, Brendan Dixon's brother, uh, Remy Dixon. So yes, um, this is just a short vlog about me because um, I'm starting to do some content on my channel now for, for you guys to see. And yes, because uh, I've seen my husband uh, do, doing it, uh, quite a few, um, Anatobia, Mal, all them. So yes, I've I've um, I've had my channel up for quite a bit now, and I've never put any content on it. But I'm going to start now. So my aim is I'm going to be doing vlogs on it and gameplays but today's video that I'm going to start off with for my channel is a vlog about me so further ado I just sit down here <coughs> obviously my admin is uh, Laura um, from Laura's Barbie Stories as you know because I'm I am from from there so um, yes I am but a uh, start from South Park and my date of birth is the 11th of September and yes I've recently been ma got married um, so yeah um, lots of things have happened in my life uh, I've also got a daughter now honey and at the moment I'm in I really don't know um, who the father is because before I got with Remy I was with Brendan as you guys know and um, Apparently, Brimmy tricked us. I had no idea he liked us, guys. I didn't. Hamburgers. I didn't. I had no clue. Because I always thought, you know, me and Brendan were going to be, you know, solid. But no, wasn't the case, guys. Because, oh, it all started in um, high school. And I can always remember... We were all going for prom suits, uh, for a prom, uh, was in high school, and uh, that's when I met Brendan's Brimmy, uh, Brendan's brother, Brimmy, and he was a little tall rag, <laughs> he was, he, 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 he was, um, at the time I was like, oh, he's, he's really out of control, Brendan, you know? <laughs> You know, he was, he was really, you know, and I don't know. And then I had no idea I had his eye on us. I didn't, I didn't, guys. So what happened was I was, uh, I was, um, get, I just picked up my suit for the prom. I can remember that. And, uh, yes, one thing led to another. I, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I um <clears throat> I got tripped up, didn't I? Um Remy because he, he admitted it to us um when you know when he start, the dark secret came out when it all all got revealed um that he did he did it deliberate. Uh he he put he, like he stuck his his uh, his his legs out so I could trip so there were just like hints and signs that he was that he liked us but he was afraid in case it would cause tr trouble between him and Brendan so he just kept it to resell basically for a very long time till it just got too much for Brimmy uh, to handle me and Brendan you know messing about you know together even though Brendan at the time was messing with me he had he had a boyfriend already. Oh, I'm not kidding, guys. He was with Fillmore uh, Williams, but he was messing about with me, and I had no idea. Because according to Brendan, before I say this, if any this, before we uh, carry on and everything, are you single? But at the time, Brendan was quiet in school. He was. Because he was Brimmy at the time. Um, this was before he changed his name about. Um, I say, so you're single. You nodded, because obviously you couldn't 
couldn't speak. He, he, he was just like a mouse in school, he was. Constant, um, um, you know. So, yes, yeah, me thinking none of the none of it. Um, I thought he was single. So I just carried on flirting. He, you know, he flirted with me, blah, blah, blah. And all through, you know. And then, yes. And then when it come to... Uh, yeah, um, then it was the time of the prom, like, you know, what I mentioned, uh, that's when Brimmy clipped eyes on us, and then there's other times Brendan was organising a sleepover. So, he uh, invited me, I went, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll come, Brent, I'll, I'll come, Brendan. Well, he was Brimmy at the time, because obviously, uh, uh, Luan and that called all their, all their boys Brimmy. And... Yes, uh, which is weird, but then again, I can talk. My my parents did the same, called all my me and my brothers, uh, but us. I don't know what they were thinking, calling with the same name, you know. But yeah, Brendan didn't like Brimmy's Brimmy for a name. Um, he had it for his, um, a mid, he had it he had it for um he had Brendan for the middle name, but he he like swapped it about when he got when he got um. When age of 18 or something like that he said okay moving on <clears throat> yeah come to the sleepover I was invited Craig was invited Clyde was all them all went and I did I can always remember when I walk through the door um because me um me sleeping bag I um I saw Brimmy in the doorway and he, he had a he had an overnight bag on him. It's like, Where, where's your brother off to? Brendan went, oh, he's going he's going to his nana's. And I was like, oh. So. But then, I, when I was like heading in the living room to join everybody else, I overheard Brimmy, um, speaking to his mum, saying, can I can I go to Brendan's sleepover instead? Well, Brimmy sleepover because he was obviously Brimmy at the time still because we're well, still in high school so his mum and dad wouldn't let, let him change his name yet so he was stuck with Brimmy um so Brimmy was like can I can I go to can I go to Br Brimmy sleepover instead of me nana's can I can I and then yes and then that's it and so Brimmy asked uh, Brendan, uh, even though he was Brimmy, if you know what I mean, uh, can he call, go to sleep over? But uh, Brendan was like, thought you like you want your nanas? He went, well, I want to go to sleep over for a change. <laughs> you know, Brimmy said that. And so Brendan was like, fine, bro. But you better be on your best behaviour. He went, I will, I will. So... Brimmy dropped his overnight bag, put it back in his room because he was no longer going to his nana's, and he come down and joined and joined the in the fun um, um, at the sleepover. We had pizza and everything. Why didn't I? Why didn't I cl click on then the way he was dropping his hints, Brimmy, that he liked us? He was. I don't know. He he was just given given the signs and I just didn't see it even Brendan didn't see it he was he was he he had his head and head in the clouds I think we all were <laughs> and uh yeah one thing led to another after that after the sleepover um I had a nice time and then we all went home and I can always remember Brimmy saying bye butters like you know what you, you would I was like, bye Brimmy. And yeah, that was it. And we all went home to to each other's houses. Uh, back of, after that, like back, of, you know. And um, yeah, and then then one things led to another. We went we went back at school, and um, it was just a brand new day, you know, all that new new um. Just a 
fresh fresh start basically you know and um and then all of a sudden we were all at our desk just you know mind more business um because uh brendan uh enrolled in my class um because he was with Fillmore um in Fillmore's class but he wanted to be close to me didn't he so he swapped he swapped um you know classes so it could be with me so yes brendan obviously we obviously teamed up together um we like sat next to each other in class and then one thing led to another brimmy obviously got jealous more jealous and more jealous each day um and he um he hitched a plan didn't he he got he, um he asked his friends from greendale because he did go to greendale greendale um for at first um that school first uh brimmy did um he had a couple of friends there that he used to hang with and they helped him and he went will you help us out because he's he's after so he was after this guy talking about me and he explained and his friends went we'll, we'll go for it so what they did was they hired a girl to pretend to be brimmy who he's going to be mom to enroll him in south park high school elementary high school i could not believe it guys I had no idea that was Brimmy in the in the, the skies. Brendan didn't know. Nobody knew. That's how sly Brimmy was. So, um, yeah, they hired this girl to pass for Dylan's mum. Because that's what he named himself. Brimmy, uh, D Dylan. So he had the wig on, the clothes, all that, and just a new, different person. And obviously the girl had to pretend that he that they paid some mo money to, to to pretend to be uh, Dylan's parent, aka Brimmy. So she brought uh, Dylan into school and and obviously um, you know uh, enrolled him in and and that was it. Um, we all thought it was just a new boy starting starting with school. And um, well, well, like hi, hi, you know. And I thought he was dishy. Uh, go make guys even though I, at the time I was flirting with Brendan. And I don't know. There was I just I was like, oh, I've come getting the flutters and that, and because at the time um um I really didn't know what Brendan was really in a relationship. Um, that's how sly Brendan was at the time. He never told me anything. All I got was was flirts from him. We even made love a few times, you know, in school. All that, oh, hamburgers. And um, so technically, I didn't have a boyfriend then. Um, I was kind of basically on the side kind of thing. So when I told, when I stayed at Dylan and he stayed at me, um, we chatted. I was like, oh, he's a dishy, you know. <laughs> I wonder if he's single. And there, yeah. Then one thing led to another. He said he was single. And uh, he asked us out. I says, you know what? Because I was sick and tired of Brendan. I was waiting for Brendan to ask us out and I wasn't getting anywhere, guys. He just did not once. So... So I, I gave uh, Dylan a go, didn't I? But I didn't know it was Brimmy in disguise, did I? Did I heck? <laughs> <clears throat> so, yeah. So I was uh, dating Brimmy as Dylan. I uh, had no idea. I thought it was just a normal normal boy. And, um, yeah, everything went well between we. And once Dylan caught... W I mean, once Brendan caught wind of uh, me in a relationship, Whoa, he wasn't having none of it. But I said to Brendan, I'm sorry, I was sick and tired if you're not um, asking us out, Brendan. I don't know what, I don't know why you weren't. I was, I was waiting for him to, you know, ask us. He never did. 
he never did guys and he wondered why I moved on and so Brendan was not having none of it Craig even oh they really picked on Dylan you know the the, the pair of them were like proper bullies to him and uh, then when it come to camp all that oh go oh, what a mess they even they even put the food down him and that it was horrible guys um so the the teacher says are you all right dylan because even though they they didn't even know it was <laughs> they, they thought it was just a guy called dylan as well um because it was registered on his profile oh hamburgers so uh the teacher told dylan to go and wash up um like get you get yourself cleaned up so i went to uh, dylan's dorm uh see if he was all right yeah he is he was you know just after the shower you know sitting on his sitting on the bed on one on the bunk bed where he, where he shares with and um he looked down in his cell i was like just don't let Br brendan that get here bullies bullies will get paid back in the end they always do he smiled. I can almost remember that. He smiled at us. So then, when camp was over, all that, I got a text off Dylan, didn't I? A.K.A. Brimmy. He had to end it with us. Because his excuse was his family's moving away. And obviously he has to go with them. With them. But it really turned out to be Brimmy, obviously, but he had to end it for one reason only, because his parents were getting suspicious. Because he, uh, he kept swapping schools, didn't he? Because he kept missing a lot from of Greendale. And, yeah, on purpose. So, he's, so he's, his parents were, like, getting getting mad and that. Why is he skipping school for? That's not like, not like Brimmy. Because he... Because he was just really spending time in my school, you know, as as someone else. So he says, "I can't do, I can't do this anymore." Even though it was fun. So yeah, he just said in the text, "I'm moving away with my parents." Because so blah blah blah. So I was left heartbroken because Dylan was my first ever, you know, boyfriend. Well, Brimmy. And. I just didn't know. I was sad in that. Brendan that were trying to cheer us up and that they were it took us days, weeks, you know, to try and get over with Dylan. Because he was just hard. He was just he was just lovely. He was guys. Yeah. All the fun times, you know. We went to the pictures together, it was lovely. Um was and then then when it come to uh, then what was it <sighs> then we're finally I finally like you know got over it after a while I move on with my life so I was just single in school you know Brendan was still trying to flirt with us so I did eventually you know just we just went back to flirting me and him this is why am I not getting anywhere with Brendan if, if he's flirting with us he must like us at some point but I he just never wants us to say and I was wondering why is he why is he so but yeah all this time he was in a relationship but anyways so as time goes by we're still enjoying school blah 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 and Brimmy uh, got more jealous and jealous every day so he turned around to his parents and says Mom, I don't, I don't, 
I don't want to go to Greendale anymore. Is it possible if, if I can go in Brendan's school? You know. And his mum and dad says, why do you not like Greendale, Brimmy? Brimmy was like, because I don't really get on with anybody. No one really likes us there. So he's just like making excuses and that. then again, I don't know if that's excuses or could be true because Brimmy was a terror. Um, possible. He probably, I don't know. Anyways, uh, so his mum and dad considered it, even though they were, even though we only had about two year left in school, was it? Um, so, so Brimmy ended up uh, enrolling enrolled in as himself this time Brendan I couldn't believe it he was like why is my brother joined join my school why why he, he, he was oh he's fuming he was but so <clears throat> Premier did enroll enroll and he started liking it and Well, according to him, because he told us, he says he was always staying at us in school, you know, giving us the eyes and that. Obviously, didn't didn't freaking twig uh, on. And uh, I remember passing him that each day in the dinner hall and that. He was like, hi, you know, it's giving us the hi and all that. I was like, well, hi, Brummy, you know, all that, didn't, didn't think not, none of it. And uh, then when school was over at the reunion, obviously Brummy was a bit late, um, um, you know, starting um, South Park Elementary, so he didn't really go um, because it was no point because he, he was only in the South Park High School for two years, so... So he was he didn't go to the reunion, but all the rest of them did, and oh yeah, Fillmore never Kate went either. So everybody else did. Turned up at the reunion. Um, you know, after being in school all this time, and yep, yeah, everyone was glad to see each other. You know, after all them years, blah blah blah. <laughs> you know, even though I was still single at this day. Um, so, but then something happened, guys. I was just sitting on my Todd, and uh, no, it was Brendan. He was um, he was sitting on his Todd, and I was with Kevin and all them. You know, a bunch of bunch of them, Kyle, Kenny, all them, and. And was it Kyle that said, what is this, your stalker? So I, I looked over. I was like, what are you on about stalker, Kyle? It's, it, that's a, that's Brimmy. Um, remember uh, when he used to hang with her at Go the Fair and that, you know, on the, in the beach? So, so I went over and speak to him. I was like, why are you on your tard and that, blah, blah, blah. He finally spoke, didn't he? And yes, uh, it's when I first finally heard his voice, and uh, I was like, "Oh, what a nice voice!" <laughs> so um, yeah, we got talking, me and him, and then he told us the truth that he was in a relationship in school, and and I was just a bit on the side. But he wanted he wanted me a bit more. He was devastated that I was with a, a boy called Dylan. He just couldn't, you know, believe it. But I says, I had no choice, Brendan, because you never want us to out. He's like, I'm sorry. I just couldn't at the time because I was obviously with someone. It's like, oh, thanks for that. So yes. Um, so yeah, comes Brendan, he was texting Fillmore. He finally ended it with him, didn't he? Because he wanted to be with me. So, he says, get us a drink and I'll think about it. You know, after lying to us all this time and that. And keeping us in the dock. So eventually, yes, we did get together, I mean him. It was lovely. 
and then one thing led to another we all went to California moved there and yeah it was lovely me and him lasted a few months yeah a few months till till Brimmy got more jealous didn't he when he when he when he found out that Brendan was dating us when he found when he saw it on his social site Brimmy was not having none of it he was like how dare he go with my ex <laughs> you know you know Brimmy and Brimmy like Brimmy's like so what did Brimmy do he um asked his parents if he could come and go and see his brother visit him so his parents you know let him as Brimmy could, but really he was really coming back coming for me I had no idea Brendan had no idea nobody had no idea what was going on but his hat but his but his plan was to get back with me and like take me off Brendan basically and get back with me everything just got out eventually it just took a while guys but oh what a mess so yeah and then uh, uh one thing led to another Brimmy obviously would put on the air uh, charm he he um like pff, faked you know if not like not interested in me you know all that, that you know just putting it on so no one got suspicious, you know. So what he did was he used Filmo, Brendan's ex, at the time, and um, he used Filmo so he could get close to me again. Because technically Brimmy is not Filmo's type. Uh, I mean, Filmo's not Brimmy's type. That's what he says. He was just, you know, he's just like a decoy kind of. If he feels bad, like he says, he feels bad doing for using a film or like that, but it was the only way for it. So the next step for Brimmy's plan, and he wanted to stay over number eleven, because that's where I was at the time. Number eleven. This was before the bomb happened. All that blah blah blah. Oh, everything's just happened, guys. So, so yes, uh, so Willem, Willem stay over because he was originally in number 18, was it? Um, because of the, the flatmates, you know, all that got, got moved about because he ended up in number 18, Brimmy, and Filmo ended up in number 17 at the time. And yes, uh, so he was always pretending to date Filmo then. Um, so the, yeah, this is, this was his plan. Ooh, <laughs> Brimmy. That's, so, his plan in action, wasn't it? Is to stay, to stay, um, in number 11 for the night. And then, he faked a tantrum, didn't he? Because he's good at putting tantrums on and that. Sometimes he can, he, the real ones, sometimes he can fake them. That's what Brimmy's like. So, he knew if Brendan took off his shoes, right, that was, that's his um, plan. Because Brimmy hardly ever takes off his shoes, as he's an old guy. He's, he is, he's a nightmare. <laughs> um, sometimes he listens, sometimes he doesn't. Uh, but <laughs> hamburgers. So yes, Brendan, um, so the only way he could come in was um, if he took off his shoes. So he kind of kicked up a fuss a bit. He was like, alright, oh, I'll get them off. And then eventually he must have had it in his head saying, I want my shoes back on. And basically he took a fit, didn't he? So me, Brendan, that were busy eating with mac and cheese at the time. Um, Cause yeah, it was it was yeah it was getting getting pretty dark then. And yes, uh, well, well, 
um, enjoying my mac and cheese and then all of my roommates were around and that because um, Brendan was also sleeping um, in number 11 um, but yeah Brimmy didn't like the fact that me and Brendan were that close so that's why he drove a wedge between we and he said he's, he had enough and that's how he ended up staying staying in number 11 so he could drive a wedge between we and not just that he slept in the same bed as we so he made sure he was in the middle ha oh, ha oh guys so so you were so he was you know so me and brendan were like separated and then uh yep yeah. and then the next day i had no idea again brimmy was just smiling at us again and again he's like He's like, are you happy, Brainy? Are you happy? And he went, ha ha, you know, like something like that. Why didn't I twig? Why didn't I twig? Oh, nobody did. And then me and him ended up going shopping because apparently his roommate at the time wanted shopping as well. But Brimmy, uh, come clean. He says his mates didn't ask him to go shopping. Uh, you know, Dex and that he was mo he moved in with. He volunteered to um to do the shopping because he knew I was for my roommates. That's how it all come about. Obviously, Brendan had to go to the hospital to see his other brother because of you know the quads um, at the time. So. Um, yeah, one thing led to another. Me and Brimmy went shopping, as you know, and we got talking and that. And oh, why didn't I? Oh, the time. What the heck was I on? Cloud nine or something? Why didn't I twig the way he was going on around us? And then when it come to the uh, uh, the checkout, he had a he had a bottle of vodka in his hand. I was like. And he was t trying to purchase it. But uh, the man stopped him and asked for ID. And I was like, why are you buying vodka, um, Brimmy? Brimmy just looked at us. You know, he had like tears in his eyes. I was like, why are you, why are you, why are you, why are you buying vodka, Brimmy? He didn't tell us, did he? He was, he was just trying to fob it off. He was, and then he just said, I'd, I like a drink now and then. It's like, do you? Brendan never told us that. And then he just said, don't tell Brendan. He doesn't know what I drink. It's like, all right then. You know. So then, um, and I says, there's something up with you, Brimmy. He says, it's not. But then he, he sighed and went, can I tell you after, afterwards to I'm hungry. So I went, all right, we'll go to the, we'll go to the fish shop. So we did. We had some chicken and chips, you know, with their curry sauce and um, we drink. And then when I was busy texting Brendan, see how, how the hospital went, you know, and, and how his brother is. What did Brimmy do? He leaned, he leaned in and kissed me lips. I was shocked. I was like, Brimmy, what are you doing? He looked at us and then turned his head. I was like, you just kissed me. He went, no, I didn't. I was like, yes, you did. What was that for? And then he tried to skittle away. I went, ah, get back here. And I was like, what, what, why did you kiss us? He broke down, didn't he? He says, I've got a crush on you. All right, because at the time... He had to just say that he, this was his first crush on us because at the time I didn't know anything in the past what he was up to in that. But it all got out, didn't it? Mm, around about Christmas time. That was when the actual truth come out. Oh, what a, what a night that was. So, yeah. So yeah, at the time Brimmy 
you know, I had to just make a make an excuse uh, make an excuse up saying this was his first crush on us. But not really. He just said it. And then uh, and I says, I just had to like. I uh, I says I can't do that. I can't just do this to Bur Bren and Brummy, and you can't do this to Fillmore. So even we finished with fish and chips, and he says I'm just going to stay down here for a bit to think. I was like, hope you're going to be all right. He went, I will be. He said, I will be. I had no idea what his next plan was, did I? Oh, hamburgers. So, Brimmy, what he did was, he went on the beach, had a few tantrums, tantrums on the beach, because he told us what he did, and he must have passed out from crying. And, and he obviously just lost it. So he got his, uh, he got his card, he had a, quite a bit of money on his card, and he went on a, on a spending spree. Dressed as his brother, didn't he? Got Brennan's wig. You know, his socks, you know. Because Brimmy's got the rest of the... He's... The, oh, sorry about that. And, um... Yep. Yeah. So he... We, he, um, he got himself in a hotel, didn't he? Uh, as Brendan. And... Kind of took over him. Took, took over his brother and I had no idea and I thought that was Brendan oh, flipping heck so Br Brimmy as Brendan um, texts us and says will you um, we come to the hotel with us and spend the night I went alright alright I will so I told my roommates Clyde and that I'm, I'm, staying, I'm staying out the night I should have told them where I was going, guys. They thought I was cheating. What a mess. What a mess. So I just said, I'm sleeping out. And I'll be back tomorrow. So I got in a taxi to the hotel. And there he was, Brimmy as Brendan. La, sitting, on, sitting on the bed. And then... One thing led to another, and we slept together. And that's how honey come about. And the question is, I was I slept with Brendan as well, um, so I really don't know who Honey's dad is, but I'm going to do the DNA guys on it. Everyone's pointing the brimmy, the dates, even the doctors think as well, the dates, everything. Anyways, um, so yeah, yeah, it all got out. Brendan found out brimmy liked us, all that, blah blah blah. The fated, the fated over us, didn't the? <gasps> Hamburgers. I was torn between the pair of them because I started, you know, getting feelings for brimmy. I don't know guys, it just, oh. and then <coughs> it was just like a love triangle I was in, I just didn't know who to choose, it's just torn between the pair of them, and then when I found out Brimmy was my first ever boyfriend, all this time, he, he was Dylan, that was Dylan, I just, I just loved Brimmy even more, when I look in his eyes, how can I forget these them eyes when I think about it, guys? So well, then after that, after when the dog secret came out and that, I was pretty mad because obviously I, I was fooled, and uh, but then I was like, well, what the heck? And then, then one thing led to another, and Brimmy proposed to us. And, and now we're married. And then I've just not long had a little a little girl called Honey. Possibly could be the dad. Or could be Brendan. So yeah, that's my life so far, guys. And sorry if this vlog was a bit too long. 
also I also found out I've got another brother out there. It's gonna, I'm gonna, it's gonna find, I'm gonna find it hard to track him down. But as three. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and and I'll see you in my next vlog, or I might do a gameplay for you guys. I don't know. And I'll introduce you to Honey as well in one of my vlogs. But for now, thank you guys for watching and take care and stay safe out there. But as out. <laughs>